Hello everyone and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda I Word Sword. Last time around we finished off the fire sanctuary and we beat Girahim. And today we're actually starting off here in the Thunderhead because there's a goddess treasure for us to collect in here. So that's why I decided to start us off in here. And also, yeah, as you can see, it's over. Well, you can't actually see it, but it's over here on the main island. And uh, there's actually a couple of things I want to take care of before we go down to the Faron Woods and the Sealed Grounds. I just want to get my bottle that I got in the last episode, I do believe. So I want to head back to town for that and just check a couple of things there. And is the treasure up top? It's looking like that. Yes, it, yes it is. Well, that was easy to find and much easier. Wrong way. There we go. Much easier to find than the, than the other one that we got in here. Anyway, we got a small bomb bag. You can hold five extra bombs to carry with you when you need, need extra firepower. When you want some more bombs. So anyway, I'll head back to town real quickly. So I'll see you guys in just a minute. Hello there, hello darling, yes, great, I'll just, I'll just go, uh, I'm, I'm in a very much of a hurry, yes, so, yes, indeed, I got, I got a bottle, and um, where did my, okay, I want to move the story, there we have it, the bottle, uh, what do I want to, want to replace, I think I want to replace the bug metal, and just because I want things to be kind of symmetrical, let's do that, so we got Two potions with, or two bottles with fairies here, and then two empty bottles here. You never know when you're gonna need four of them. You just never know. But uh, anyway, let's head to the sealed grounds and see what's actually going on down there. So, let's go there to the sealed grounds. So anyway, this is the first session that I'm doing since I went away on vacation, or I went away for a week, basically. So anyway... Let's just go down to the sealed grounds, and let's do this. Because as, you, as we heard from Fee, uh, something is apparently going on here in the sealed grounds. I don't know what, but we might actually want to check out those rocks down there, because I'm still not sure if you can bomb them. Oh. I just realized that there is a pathway now up here. Well, that took a little bit of time for me to realize. And we got this thing here. Okay. That looks a little bit blurry, actually. So that's kind of strange. But we got a bit of a track here. So, it's actually... Before we do anything else, let's just give some heart. Some love. Some power of love. Let's get that. There we go. We're actually at 18 heart containers. So we're very close, actually. Finishing off that, I guess. But anyway. I'm back! It's been a while. Impa. It has definitely been a while. Ah, your sword. There can be no doubt. The sacred flames have purified this blade. Well done, Link. A sword holds tremendous power. That power is a sacred force. And it's a sacred force. Use the force, Link. I feel the f that you got some great power within you, Impa. And look at Gruz over there! He's <laughs> petrified! He's just... It is a divine power left to us by the gods of all. The same power that is spoken of in the Ballad of the Goddess. To look upon, upon you, to see that same great power now flowing through you and the sword you carry. Come, Link. You must now open the Gate of Time. Now that the Sacred Force dwells within your blade, strike the Gate of Time with the Skyward Strike and it will surely awaken. We don't have the odds on our side. Never tell me the odds! I'm sorry, I just had to do that. Or, IT'S A TRAP! Climb upon the pedestal and show the gate your sword's power. I'm sorry, I just... I just couldn't stop... I couldn't make a Star Wars reference there when, it, when they talk about the Force. Yo, Link! Sorry, yeah, I did! What's what's it for? Duh! Oh, you'll see before long! Oh, really? Will I? And uh, this over here is something that uh, I think is part of a side quest a little bit later on, but 
That's just something to think of, I guess. But we gotta strike this. Gate of time. Whoa! No, I fear the seal has given way once again. That terrible beast is awakening even as we speak. It is likely that the monster reacted to the sacred power given off by your sword. I wish it had not happened, but there was no other way to open the gate, so it goes. Link, you must imprison the beast once again! <laughs> Alright, bring it on! Yeah. What is... This is what I've been waiting for. It's time to break out my new toy. Trust me, that flabby bag of teeth doesn't stand a chance. Well, what are we waiting for? I'm heading out there! I knew this was a trap all along. I shouldn't have done that! It was a trap. So anyway, let's go outside and imprison that beast that we once did in episode... Was it 30, I think? Uh, I think it was the first episode that uh, this series came back that we imprisoned that beast. So it's been a little while since we've seen the guy. Hey, Link! Yeah. ta -ha! Try not to drool on your shirt as you stare at this amazing super weapon I've been working on. I call it the Grusonator! Dun dun dun! Leaves you speechless, doesn't it? That's only natural. You wouldn't believe how much time I put into building this beauty! Here, check it out! First, I got all the fences cluttering the area out of the way. Then, I laid down race for it to run on, all by myself, of course. Jeez, y you must have had a lot of time on your hands, Groose. I don't know what came over me. I had no clue I had the talent to make something like this, you know. Anywho, anyhow, just tell me where you want me to place my shots, and I'll put a hurting on that ugly monster. I don't care how beefy you are, you're bound to stumble for a few moments after taking one of my big bumps to the body. Hang on though. That monster showed up a smidge sooner than I was expecting. There are a few final adjustments I gotta make before she can move on the rails I put down. I'll call out to you when she's ready for action. Till then, do whatever you can to hold off that beast! Do whatever I can, so... He's back- Oh! I thought that- I thought I would actually kinda like dive down. But I gotta use my cloth. Look at that! Seems like our ugly friend grew itself a pair of hands! Great timing! Hope he knows how to catch, because my machine has a mean right arm! When she's all loaded up, I'll, I'll let you know. Until then, do what you need to stop it. So here we go! Our rematch against the Imprisoned! God dang it. It's so... <laughs> and this kind of... I don't know, but... Just like the Empire Strike Back, I don't know. Continuing on that theme of Star Wars, you know. We got the bad guy here, making uh, making himself some moves. Let's just get rid of that. I don't know, and... Hey Link, the machine's all loaded and ready to smash. If that flabby sack of teeth tries to climb the wall, I can blast it off from here with a bomb. When he wants some backup from me, just send me the signal with up. So, let's send the signal with up. Alright, it's time for Gross to explode into action! Really, Gross? Really? Adjust the machine's position with the control stick and aim at your target with the Wii remote. Once you finish aiming, press A to launch a bomb. If it is, you'll stun the scaly sucker. You forget the control press too, yeah, yeah. The Grusinator to review the tricks. So, there we go. Aim, set, fire! Yeah, the Empire really strikes back! Ha! She backs a mean punch, doesn't she? I tell you, I was in, I was in love the first time I pulled this lever! I'm start loading her back up with another bomb, so keep beating on Big Ugly till I give you the signal. Indeed I will! So, let's hit those pinky toes! No, don't put away your sword, there we go! Oh no, no! I just realized that. Okay, she's really, or it's really slow now. 
And just as I was about to get hit, the imprison falls down and... Okay, I guess it doesn't... Oh, how am I supposed to... I'm, uh... Can I get around some somewhere? Uh, do I have to run around? I guess so. Oh, don't run out of time, please. Yeah, I can hear you, Groot. I don't have time for this. No, I got it from underneath. There we go. And there we go. And bam. There we go. And with great timing, I guess, Groos has his Groosinator ready again. So, I... Okay, that was some bad timing. Hit it, there we go. Yeah, I know you're ready, Groos. But this thing isn't trying to scale, scale the wall quite yet. But good thing that you're ready. Because I'm probably going to be needing it. Sing. Yeah, 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 I know. Oh, here we go. Get a couple of it's off and <laughs> I'm doing not very well in this fight it seems No oh Yeah Okay now he's trying to scale the walls again Are you ready Grusinator? You ready for this? Or are you I should say are you ready the imprisoned because this is the return of Return of the Jedi BAM! Headshot! And it's going to be slow for a little while. And then let's just... Get this... Oh no! Let's just run a little bit ahead of it. And now hit it! Hit it! There we go! And you will fall on your back once more! This is pretty much just... Almost... Yeah, almost the exact same fight like... Uh, like last time. Uh, oh, we're going to start down here now. Whoa, 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 okay. So, let's dive down. So yeah, this is almost the exact same fight. In, but in, but uh, we got some other things here. And perfect landing like a glove. Oh, Groot is, Groot is ready once more. And I'm ready. I said I'm ready. What? What? No! Oh, why? I hit it from underneath, but Link hit it from above. God dang it. Uh, I'll be back when it when it's down on its uh, back again. Because that was just silly. Alright, I hit it. <laughs> I hit it with a bomb in the animation, actually, and it's down once more. So, anyway, I guess we have to... Do, do it like this. Yeah, that makes... Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, don't tell me I messed up again. I may have actually messed up again. Oh god, please. This is the worst run of this boss, like, ever. Oh, okay. Okay, come on now. No, hit it from under... Link, there we go. I guess I... I guess I wasn't standing uh, close enough, I guess. There we go. And now it's glowing red. Oh no! Oh no! Groos, I think we might be needing your help now. Swarm fire! Hit it. I guess we hit it, just hit it in the leg. Okay, okay then. So it stopped. Okay, that. Or I don't know if the bond helped or anything. By the way, that's kind of a. I wouldn't say creepy sound, but the sound is like. Just when that thing goes fro up from, it, from its head. So anyway, let's actually go up a little bit. Let's see where it's going. It's going over there. And now run! Run like the wind, Link! Run like the- Oh, it's getting really- Really cl Or not really- Really, really close. Uh, Gru Groose is all ready again. But yeah, it's getting- It's getting decently close, so let's jump down. Perfect. Now let's- Not- Get hit. No, I missed. Oh, no. oh. God dang it, I missed again and I got hit. No, no, I missed. Oh, no, no, please. 
No! Come on! No, I got I got one hit, hit on that! No, one more! And then there we go! Third time's the charm! There we go! When is it next? When yeah I can hear I can hear you Groose! I don't know when it's going to try and oh jeez! Scale the walls uh, one more time, or next time I should say. So let's actually try and get a little bit in front of it, like that. Oh dear! Oh dear! Here we go! Get a couple of good shots. There we go! Oh no! Well, except for the fact that I got hit, that, that was pretty good. Uh, yeah, okay, I may need Groos here, because he's getting really close, so... Let's aim, set, fire! Hit in it! Hit its hand! I think it's... I think it may get stunned then. Okay, yeah, it is stunned. That makes... That makes things a whole lot easier. There we go. And now, he is almost Im Im immobile, or immobile. So there we go. And this should be the final strike, but we gotta go, we got we gotta glitch around, no go around. Like this, and up here. And please don't fail me now. Gotta stand close. Nope. There we go, and done! Now Link, strike the ceiling spike with a skyward strike and restore the seal quickly, just like last time. So, okay, <laughs> I wanted to jump down there, but the game didn't let me. Thank you very much, game. Thank you very much. That was definitely not the best run of that boss, but anyway, strike it. Nice work there, Link. Of course, you couldn't, couldn't, couldn't have done it without me, but no need to thank Cruz. I know I saved your tail. Now let's get that Gato time thing up and running. I'll go on ahead. Yeah, let's gonna do that. But first, I wanna check some rocks. And I haven't actually noticed these paintings before. Uh, I just saw them in the cutscene, and they're interesting to look at, I guess. So, anyway, I wanna try bombing some rocks down here. So, if there's nothing in them, or if nothing happens, I guess I'll see you guys back up to the top. <laughs> 